Hello everyone, and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. And today, I'm going to be showing you how to download and install, and uh, also use, the Prax client for uh, Minecraft 1.20.62. Um, this is a really cool thing, because, you know, it's a hack client. It works really well on the Hive, which I'll be showing you. And, um, yeah, without further ado, let's just get right into it. Alright, so, what you're going to want to do is you're going to head over to this site right here, their GitHub page. Which is, um, I'll leave in the description for you guys to just go here, or you just copy, uh, this right here, um, into your browser, any browser, and, um, it'll take you right to their latest release, and you're just gonna scroll down here until you find this assets thing, it's gonna be the prax.dll, you're just gonna wanna download that, um, it'll pop up here, and I'll show you, so once you download it, it's gonna say, unverified download blocked, uh, you're just gonna hit download, you're just going to download it, and it'll it'll say right there that it's done. If it's not showing up for you, and it just says like a Windows thing that it was blocked, or you know something like that, I'll leave a video down in the description for on how to fix that. And um, yeah, that'll just show you how to fix that problem. So um, when you download the Fate Injector, it's not gonna do the Windows thing. You just you'll just you'll just be able to download it. So again, I'll leave a, a link to the GitHub page of for the Fate Client Injector. You just want to download it right here, and then it'll pop up right here. And then you're just gonna want to run and install this, and then it'll just like uh, do a little pop up here. I don't know if you can see it, but it'll just do a little small window pop-up that uh, you'll be able to use and run and later. Alright, so once you have both of those downloads and once you have the Fate Injector kind of like opened up like this, you're just going to want to uh, get to this click on the Prax download and then it's going to work in the Fate Injector here. You can just uh, open up Minecraft now um, and then once Minecraft fully opens up and loads, you can just hit inject then it should uh, work, so I'll skip to when Minecraft is fully loaded. Alright, so as you can see here, Minecraft is uh, fully loaded, uh, so you're just going to hit inject on the fake client injector. And as you can see, uh, there you go. You have the Brax client injected, and um, I'm going to show you how to use it. So, once you have this, you can just load into like any world you want, it doesn't really matter. Um, I'm just gonna go on like just some world or something and uh show you guys how to use it. It is pretty simple. Um there's a lot of things you need to know, or I guess you need to know that uh goes into this. But uh yeah, it's pretty freaking easy. Alright, so uh once you load it in, it's kinda just gonna look like this. Kind of like plain and stuff, not really anything cool. Um but uh, the way you open like all the hacks and stuff is just going to your chat and typing dot bind, click GUI, and then whatever key bind you want it to have, or whatever you want it to open. So for me, it's just gonna be R. And uh, once you press that key bind, it's gonna open up with all of these hacks here that you can go through and choose. Um, you know, so there's a lot of things you can do. Uh, it's really cool because there's a lot of uh, a lot of things you can do like name tag thing. It's pretty cool um, I don't really like having RC uh, IRC on it's just like the global chat of all of Brax client So, uh, you know, you don't really need that on if you don't want it uh, There's reach you just you just right click it and it'll come up with this thing and just turn that on you know so like, you know, I haven't really tested anything, you know, so like, you know, it's like more reach and stuff. There's also like Kill Aura, there's a lot of cool features to this. Not sure if it's better than Horion or not, um, if you guys want a video on that, I'll make a video on that. But um, yeah, uh, thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!